Hey guys, my name is KNL Arnell for short, and I want to talk to you today about my SM experience. It was so much fun. I'm sorry this video is like a lot, like a lot of days late, but I just been busy, I guess. <laughs> but oh my gosh, you guys are gonna want to take my advice because it's guaranteed to get you into the audition or pass or like make you feel more confident in yourself. Yeah? Okay, let's start. So when we found the hotel, um, parking wasn't open for some reason, so we ended up parking somewhere else that was like a block away from the actual hotel and we had to pay $6, which was kind of like, uh, because I didn't really want to pay money to park and they voucher parking in the hotel so I don't know what that was but when we got into the actual hotel it was so amazing oh my gosh I could not believe it like the Sheraton Hotel I'm going to spend like my vacation there next time if I ever like visit LA again but yeah oh my goodness it was so beautiful like the mall was in the hotel like I never seen that before that was so awesome so yeah I was excited about that but um, I was very excited because you can see all the SM signs locating um, that the audition was downstairs and oh my gosh it was downstairs there was like a lot of stairs we tried to take the elevator downstairs but um we kind of got like lost on it every time we thought we were going down we were actually going up then we would realize it, it was too late, so we got off and started walking again. <laughs> As we got down to the actual audition hallway thingy that led into the audition room, oh my goodness, it was so nerve-wracking. There was a lot of good-looking Asian people, and I was just like, I'm not meant to be here exactly. <laughs> and like, there was just stairs, and I was just like, intimidated I was just like Ugh, they're so beautiful but um as we got into the room I felt like there was a whole lot of different kind of people different races there wasn't just Asians so like that kind of saved me there a little bit I was so nervous <laughs> as we entered me and my friend um, my friend she said she was going to audition with me but she kind of dropped out last minute so I was just like why? Why are you making me do this by myself? I'm going to be in that room alone. There's nobody there to support me. Cause like everyone who was supporting had to wait outside for their friends and there was just so much people. But once I got in there, there was just that one lady, that one lady that had to do her job that was just like on her job, like right on it, on point. For all of you who auditioned, you know who that exact lady is. The one who's like, put your cell phones away, blah, 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 blah. I mean, cause I'm like supervisor, what? <laughs> but throughout that, she just kept saying, put your cell phones away. If I have to tell you twice, if I give you three times, if I can tell you four times, you're not auditioning. And I was just like, my, my mascara and eyeliner is running. Can, can I at least go to the bathroom or use my phone? She was like, no! I had to tell you like two, three times, do you want to audition or not? And I'm just like, can I go to the bathroom? She was like, no, you cannot leave this room. I was like, can I pee in the trash can or something? What do you want me to do? That room was huge, the waiting room. You could stretch out, practice singing, whatever. There was just a lot of people there and a lot of chairs. And like the whole time in there, I was practicing my song, which was Motherland by Crystal K. And I was like really thirsty because I didn't have no water. But I neglected to look around the room because there was actually water there. And I felt like an idiot because everybody else saw that and I didn't. But um, I met some wonderful people there. They were so awesome and really nice. If, if, if you guys are out there, holla at a sister, you know. Like, um, once you're in the room and stuff, they take you by groups of 30. And once you're in that group, you're waiting for like the group before you to finish auditioning. 
and you go into this small hallway and from there they take you about groups of like 10 5 to 10 how many kids fit in the audition room and so like then from in the audition room they take you by groups of five or how many people can fit on the um, yellow line so the audition room there's the judge there's the camera person there's the camera and there's like 10 of you behind a yellow line like, I'm guessing you can't pass that unless you're a dancer so and on top of that there's the people waiting for their turn watching you watching the judges and the judges are watching you so of course you're going to be nervous and if you have so much courage good for you like I had courage all up until like it got to me then like my lips start twitching <laughs> it was like uncontrolled like <laughs> overall like you have to have the courage to audition and I know you got this because you already auditioned and if you don't get picked you know just keep trying like they accept everyone that's the part that I liked about it they didn't care like who you are what you look like what race they accepted you to audition <laughs> but the thing that I noticed was the um, lady who was judging us she did not look like she had time for anyone. She was like, I already heard people today. I'm tired of hearing people. <sighs> this job is annoying. At least she didn't have that lady's job who was like, put the cell phones away! Because I wanted to slap her. I'm sorry, lady, I know you were doing your job, but shut up. Please. So tips for surviving the SM auditions. Woohoo! Number one. What you want to do is be confident and believe in yourself because there's only one of you and if you don't believe in yourself then who will plus the judges will be able to spot like confidence right on so who know you may be the one that they'll like pick out of like the million of us number two make new friends and meet new people yeah so you guys already shared the common fact that you like K-pop and you probably have the same biases. Watch out. This song is mine. So like, just go ahead and go for it. They'll give you courage and you're more likely to give them courage also. Plus who knows, you might make a lifetime friend. I love those. Number three, only worry about yourself. The more you worry about other people worrying about you, the more nervous you're going to become. Trust me, it happens. Just worry about yourself. No one's really looking at you. They all came here for the same reason you did, to get accepted in the SM. Number four, be excited and hyper. Yeah! Not only would you be excited and like all over the place, but it also get other people like hyped up too. And plus the judges notice that, so why not get the judges' attention? <laughs> and finally, number five, just be yourself. Do what you came to do, which is own that audition and get in the SM. What? Yeah, who knows? Um, maybe you'll get the judges' attention again and you might be the next super junior or exo or wonder girls wait wait i <laughs> girls generation <laughs> don't kill me so yeah thank you guys for watching i hope this really helped and if you have any more questions to ask me or anything like hit me up at my email or just leave a comment down in the comment section i will get like back to that asap trust me there's probably a lot of things I didn't explain in this video, but I hope this was able to help you all. So thanks for watching. Bye. That bring mints or gum. I think that helps clear your 